don't know what's going on in that bus there. It's the party bus. Coon Cassius IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. We're at the Zone launch here, head of fight camp. This Saturday night, Ben versus Granados. I'm joined by Mr. Banjo. The real Banjo. Hey, screw Ashley. Jordan Banjo. What's happening, Perry? And I'm assuming this is your... This is my Mrs. Naomi. It's my better half. Naomi, people on social media will be aware, obviously, of your missus. Um, can, I, can I say this, mate? You have no idea how long I've waited to hear IFL TV sponsored by Everlast. Pell, how often am I watching IFL TV? I hear your voice every day in the back of a car. On mate, the way I'm telling you, every day, every day I've listened to IFL. This is a dream, a dream <laughs> of mine. Right, listen, I'm gonna, I've got a little gripe first of all. Oh, God, right. So basically, you know, you go out of the Benz, didn't you? Yeah, right? Yeah. You go out of Connor and Victoria, right? <laughs> well, the week you went with them to Sheesh, the week before, they went out with us. Yeah. So I was drunk and I've run Connor up and I was like, what couple do you prefer the best? <laughs> the banjos or the Cassis? He's like, oh, bro, don't do that. I was like, no, no, you what answer that say? question. What did he say? What did he say? <laughs> he said us, obviously, oh, didn't he? No, no. no. <laughs> he didn't answer, he declined no. them. <laughs> <laughs> Connor Ben is headlining uh, the show this week uh, yeah. against Adrian Granados. And I know you're a big boxing fan. You yeah. come from a boxing family. People don't realise this, but they yeah, should yeah. do. Your dad, Funzo Banjo, yeah. obviously uh, famous heavyweight from, I'm, I'm going to say the 90s. 80s, 80s. 80s. Yeah, 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 a while ago. What people don't realise as well, that we were, I was at school the same time as Ashley. Did, did you knew that, didn't yeah, you, anyway? Yeah, yeah. yeah. But obviously where our school were, uh, 10 years apart etc so you could have had Ashley would have been about 5 and I could have been 15 or yeah, whatever yeah, yeah. you know so but you come from boxing background yes we do man yeah you come from a boxing background I, I wanted to fight when I was a kid and then as I got older it got to a point where my dad was like if you want to fight that much before I take you anywhere let's me and you have a little mess around no it's not for me <laughs> it's not for you have to be a certain type of guy to be able to box it's not for me I can't do it. I'm a huge fan but to actually compete Nah, so I'll stick to dancing and radio. Uh, it, right, dancing it. and radio, that'll yeah. do us. <laughs> Perry, you a boxing fan as well? Uh, do you know what? I, I tend to follow whatever Jules says. Yeah. So my <laughs> what in life or in back boxing? <laughs> well, a bit, a bit of both. But wh whatever Jules said, the result's going to be. That's where my money goes. That's where the bet goes, and it usually works. Yeah, so right. as long as Jules up to scratch, and I'm fine. Naomi, come round this way because oh, you're like coming. out of the thing here. Yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hi. So, yeah, as this is kind of centred around the whole boxing thing, are you a boxing fan or do you follow what Jordan does as well? To be fair, I am a boxing fan. Okay, I no. mean, no, I no, don't no, know no. as much as Jules. <laughs> she's I'm a fan like, of ooh, large like... guys with their tops off. That's yeah. what she's a fan of. I yeah. sit there. Myself. Basically, she's an AJ <laughs> fan. She's an AJ, she's an AJ, AJ fan. fan. That's what oh, she okay, is. Yeah. Yeah. I'll have to admit that I am. Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine anyway. But, um, yeah, um, Conor Ben, like I said, in action. But we're all fans of Conor Ben. He yeah, talks so well. He backs it up in the ring. So we're hoping he can do the business this week live on the zone. Yeah, I mean, I think he's going to do it. I think he's going to do it in fashion as well. It is Conor Ben. We look at his last fight and it was just... Well, I mean, we all knew... Well, we all hoped he was going to win. The first round knockout was just... It was brutal. Do you know what I mean? He puts his punches together well. His jab is like a spear at the moment. Everything is just levelling up constantly. Like he says, he's crushing the numbers in the gym and he's showing it. So, fingers crossed, he does the same against Granados. And then what? We're always hearing about this the zone deal, free fight deal, money this. So I'm really hoping we see a world title in the next 18 months. That's what I'm hoping for. That's why I listen to Jordan Banjo. <laughs> he knows his stuff. <laughs> Done. Well, listen, I'm going to let you guys crack on. Uh, good to see you, too, Jordan. Have a good you know time. I mean? I'll good give you one of them as well. Speak to you soon. Thank you very much.